If you're working with Bernina software in the creator level, you don't have the Corel draw that we do in the Designer Plus. Um, that's what takes you to the art canvas to be able to draw shapes and then convert them straight into embroidery. And that's fine. You, you do have mirror merge in the creator level. So what I'll do is I'll come into digitize and I'm just going to draw just a square and I'm going to go ahead and use uh, just a plain fill stitch. I don't care what size because I'm going to be changing things and I'll create a square. I'm touching H on my keyboard that gives me the nodes that I can work with and I want to make this larger to deal with. Uh, H takes you automatically to the reshaped object. What I'm going to do is just place some straight stitches around that corner and I drew a bounding box around the very corner, touch my space bar, and then move that rounded corner to where I want it. I was never able to draw a rectangle and then get four corners that matched. But by doing this, this way, I'm going to go back to my, uh, select my object, and then we'll go to the mirror merge. I'm going to select mirror merge horizontal and vertical. It doesn't matter where they fall, and I do want them to overlap. Do I want the overlap? Yes. Okay. Now I have a rectangle, and I'll think about the size of it now. Um, the project today is a 4 inch by 3 inch rounded rectangle. And now I'll go to the Edit Toolbox, Open Outlines and Offsets. I want an object outline, just a single stitch, and I'm not going to do this, and we'll say OK. So from here, then I can select my applique tool and create my patch. This fill stitch will be deleted. There's no need to have it. Thanks for watching.